How to short crypto. In this video, I'm gonna explain exactly what shorting crypto means, how to short crypto. I'm gonna do a step-by-step -step tutorial and how you can do this even if you are a US citizen. I'm gonna share my favorite platform to short crypto on. And also I'm gonna show you some strategies that you may wanna use when deciding to actually short crypto. Hi, my name's Adam Winnig, and I've been trading Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies since 2014, and we made this channel to help make your crypto trading and investing experience easy, lucrative, and fun. So let's get into this. Let's talk about shorting crypto. So the main platform that I like to use in order to short crypto is actually KuCoin. Uh, KuCoin, I love it because it is a robust platform. It is a well-known platform. And most importantly, it allows us US citizens to be able to trade futures and to be able to short the crypto market, which you can't on a lot of other exchanges like Binance. Now, if you are somebody that's international watching this, then you can do the exact same thing on Binance, but I like to use KuCoin. So the first thing that you're gonna to need to do is to set up a KuCoin account. I will include my affiliate link in the description down below, which will actually save you some fees on trading, which when you're trading a lot on uh, KuCoin, there are fees obviously involved. So this will just save you a little bit of money. So feel free to use if you want. Now, a couple things regarding your KuCoin account. You don't need to fully set up the KYC and send all your verification documents in. All you need to do is open up the account and then you need to load it with some money. You can do that by going here to buy crypto and you can either send crypto to your new KuCoin wallet address or you can buy with uh, a credit card or a debit card. Uh, but once you've got money into the account, you're gonna wanna come up here to derivatives. And what derivatives mean is it means that it's derived from something, right? So you're not gonna be actually trading the actual asset, you're gonna be trading a derivative of the asset, which is what we're doing in this case. So just come in here to derivatives and then you can click on futures classic. So once you open up the futures classic platform, it'll look something like this. You have all of your normal trading uh, tools and drawing tools here. Uh, on the left, this is just pulled in from tradingview.com. And then over here to the top left, you decide first which asset you'd like to trade. So you can see all of the different assets that you can trade and you can short here, which should be more than enough assets. So just for example here, I've selected Bitcoin and let's say for example that I wanted to short Bitcoin. So how you can do it is by first placing an order. Now there's different order types. Obviously you can do a limit order, a stop order, or you can just do a market market order, which is probably what you're going to be doing, which means you're just going to get into the market right away at the best market price, which looks like it's $20,688 at this point. Next that you need to do is basically choose the amount that you'd like to trade. So let's just say for example, you know, I just want to choose a little bit here. So I'll do like, like this, I'll do like $20 worth, right? So you choose the amount in Bitcoin or you can also trade it in lots, but it's easier just to see it in Bitcoin. You can see the number right here. Uh, this is in USDT, obviously. Or if you have your account balance, you can say, I want to trade 50% of my account on this trade, 75% or 100%. And then the next thing is that you can decide your leverage. So generally trading with leverage is quite a dangerous thing to do. So it's not necessarily recommended, but you can trade with, uh, you know, up to five leverage here. If you do further KYC, you can trade with even more leverage. Uh, but anyways, I'm not going to trade with leverage. And then you can just decide if you want to buy Bitcoin or you want to sell Bitcoin. And you can just come in here, you type in your trading password, and then there you go. Okay, so now it shows that I have entered this Bitcoin position right here. I can see it here underneath. I see that $20.69 worth. I see that my entry price was right here. And I could see that my liquidation price is right here, basically meaning that if Bitcoin does go to this price, then I'll lose all the money that I placed onto this trade. What else can you do? Okay, the next thing that you can do is you can add a take profit and stop loss. So for example, I can come in here and I can say, you know, my mark price, uh, which I think is, is good. You can just come in here and say, what do I want my take profit to be at? So let's say that if Bitcoin goes to, let's say just $20,000, just for example, then I want to take profit. And if Bitcoin goes to, 
uh, $22,000, for example, then um, I want to get out of the trade and cut my losses. So I can just go there and I can click confirm, okay? Uh, and you can see they're gonna like guide you through here. Um, but long story short, that's how you do it. Now, if you'd like to close the position, then you can just decide how you'd like to close it. You can either do it with a limit or a market order. So you can just come here and decide, hey, I wanna trade or I wanna um, close 100% of my position. And you just go ahead and click confirm. And it says cancel, take profit and stop loss orders which I'm gonna cancel those orders and boom, now I'm out of the trade. And that's essentially how you short Bitcoin or cryptocurrency. And now I bet you're probably wondering, well, when is the best times to actually do this? And if you wanna know when the best times to actually short are, uh, then you may wanna consider taking a look at our spiral guide algorithm. This algorithm was developed by a, a friend of mine that's an ex Silicon Valley engineer that's been trading Bitcoin since it was a penny. He's a quant analyst, he's absolutely brilliant. And basically this algorithm will both long and short the market. So if you're interested in doing that and having it done in an automated fashion that actually has edge, then click the link below and you can check out our spiral guide algorithm. And if you wanna see the results that it's producing, then we should have a free discord group below where we're constantly trading, buying, selling, uh, trading algorithmically as well. So you can check that out. If you like this video, then go ahead, like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any helpful videos in the future.